are tracking the investigation right now into a string of shootings that happened in Lexington. The shootings happened yesterday afternoon, each just a few miles apart on the city's north side. At least two people were injured. WKYT's Sean Moody is working to figure out if police think they're connected. It's our top story at 12:30. Sean. Since those shootings happened yesterday afternoon, Lexington police have questioned two people that we know of, but they haven't said anything about actually charging anyone with any crimes. They also haven't said whether or not they actually believe those shooting incidents are related. This all began with that shooting around 2.30 yesterday afternoon on LaSalle Road. Police said they found one victim there with critical injuries. Not long after that, they got called over to a Mr. Money shop about a mile and a half away, where witnesses said they saw someone jump out of a car and fire shots. Shortly after that, they said another victim showed up at UK Hospital with a critical gunshot wound. Then, about 4 o'clock, police got reports of another shooting over on Lima Drive, which isn't too far from LaSalle. There, they found a man down on the ground outside a store with two gunshot wounds in his back, and they believe someone took his car. Police said he was conscious when they took him to the hospital. The last time we talked with police, they weren't sure whether or not any of these shootings were connected. That's something they're looking into today. Now, later in the evening, Lexington police got another report of shots fired in the Hollow Creek area. They said they didn't find any actual shooting victims there, but they did find a car with bullet holes in it, and they think it might be related to one of those shooting incidents earlier in the day. In Lexington, Sean Moody, WKYT. Sean, thank you. A Fayette County school bus was hit by a bullet near the LaSalle Road scene. There were no students on board.